waterfall was garden Joba ke samba ne hasta lethu uwini into kazi funi kwona ukuthi ngabe ke infundo zakhe zomthelela omsebenzi lapha nawe ku plant retail joba ke into kazi ithi phuma ne elalini bafezi zaseli mpopo solo ke isakhula ke bethana udlala ngaphande idlala ngeyithelo nengitshalo bafezi na yonke ke into ehlangana nemvelo ina ke uthando lwakhe le horticulture laqala khona joba ke athi izinto zakhe azange zihambe ngendlela ngasonke isikhathi ngoba thina ke sowo ndaba ake sathana amahalavu singubhi indaba asimbona Okay, so khome e o ba re moyena ba re a itlhokomele until re go la re ba 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 kholo nako e le gore nge nkholwa ka a khudile e le mogolo so a sa khone gore tlhokomela ka o fela ga rena and then ne bo a o sibo sisters ne ba ya di college so go bile go ba bo ima go fo gore ba ba patale di fees le tsa tshwana le tse o fortunately mudimila a era the miracles ya ba gore khome e la ya tswala ya etsa bana so nkholaka atsa a uswa ka mathomo a misa ku college ja lo fela abantsi ba rekisa dikgomo gore ba re se skolong le chelete yena yena e o papa ene le mama ne ba ithola ya ba gore mama o fela ke msebetsi a bo ya gae ra sala re le fo mama ha se no fela ke msebetsi a bo ya go gae gore a re tlhokomele le nkholaka ka se nkholagane se tsena a go dile e le mogolo at the age of 102 years ka 2002 ngkhola ka atlhoko fala then ra thoma go ibutsa di question gore ke nge le gore e tlo re leader mo femeling re tlhokomela ke mang life ile ba boima as well boima ba gore ha go sana mo thatlo re ka ndijo go tshwana le ka mogone re jaka teng like na ke sa lomunya ni ke tputisha gore ke tlo ya skolong joang because of mo thona re tlhokomela ha sa le teng kile ko metric like ke bile ka ipotisha di question tsengata gore ga ke fetsa sekolo ke tloetsa eng because wa itse gore ko di rural area ha gone mothata go fang information gore ha o di carry ya di tsamayang gore nna go goleng ga ka ne ke rata gore ke phela le mama thata di challenge tse kile ka di thola ko rural area schools ke tsala tsa gore like english ya teng ne le phua ne ba ruta ka language ya rena molelo gore o ka understand la fela ga o bala ga o bolela le motho o ka se khone go bolela le yena ka language ya english or something then when coming go di computing like no sine di computer like ntse tsa go tshwara le gore maybe o ngwala di excel and stuff like that go go type di lo ne re sa itsile so ya ba gore ke etela ko ausaka Most of the friends they na kinele tsona ne ba kena sekolo ko segweng na ke kena ko rural area like he ba bolala ka di computer like ne ke ba confused like ke le wa bona a witse se le o feel a shame di gore ka ke le bua ka eng di le tsona le tseo but le na ke le ka ipotsa ka le na matsatsi ka re le na ke tlo khona o witse ka computer ke tlo khona o ba le yona ka itse everything 
Hakifeza metric. Problem ya kakore nekisine kore kito choose the career effing. Nekisine that kisa itu kore kete ing. Lomaranto ne kerata ne likare ne. So hakifita kile kaba confused. Ka apply ko health ne kore bandumela. But my passion in this in this in this in this. Can we hear because of kisa batu kisa batu wadi baka kota zhudula dule tatu na lete woman. So, but no one is happy because of what I do. I can't even remember what I did. School fees and never so cool. Fortunately, Kila Kahona passed the test. Then after that, I got my certificate. But I got a lot of fat. 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 This thing, I got a lot of fat. Because sometimes, if you don't have a lot of fat, you end up with failure and like over or losing such a little or a thing for but I just couldn't feel. After I was a young and missing, I became a player going University of South Africa for what he called. Next I just say look at what is what he called and like just understand who he. Okay, this cause is very so. I had a good plan, but I had a good plan. It was difficult for me to get a good plan on the course. But I had a try to get a good plan. I had a good plan to get a good plan. I didn't know if I was interested too much in horticulture. Before we knew, I was a king of the culturalist. I was a king of the culture. I was a king of the culture. Mesti annual le, because begitu sah terlalu banyak lori king. So, kami rasa ram puri je. Eh, kita nak terlalu banyak ro, ke entry entry bang ro is not about dia nak fella, entry buat hokwa, not for dia nak fella for lili fas kaum muka. 2014 kau fellong kau Disember papa kau ialah atau kau fella. Papa kau kena nampak terlalu rentel di jeb. Then after we talk or talk of it, it doesn't matter because unfortunately I have won anything. For one, I have over a million in school and university. Come on, she graduated. Then after that, can take apply for the internships. We know I want to push in a higher mount on the water culturalist because military, yeah, na. Kimu to pila bule la kamitari, lehari likuondo mu no pila bule la kayo na liruko mu lidi plasi kinto cha deratang lo cha nechawa wote wote. Then katama ho apply for the internships to go to other companies. Kiti kisti ni nili kampani lor ne basa i acha is a a home garden center like then. Kabeki Gugula, kuketi kesi ni like ni kiti samwani, then kaisa sivi yako kote ng'ezi postgraduate student, then libo na ba ili bang accepta kwa kiko kuketi kesi ni kio kuweza experience yako kote ng'ezi. Kwa sasa kito yako kuketi kesi ni kuweza interview ya fuhuti culturalist. Advice ng'ta mo fangi yana wini kwa ori askawa lireo kadi ya ora askawa kuma na kano kio aska chiche la mara. Because kila mulo ro ra te ono ra te kami lipilu limo. Hanga talam sevedi kila tete mama se na se bata mo pilum bahaye maybe inga mara kila tama finisha ene na for na kore kila talam sevedi wa hoti kila tarasi inga ba very happy because inga lin inga ba a young worker talam kore akabali a small garden center or landscaping just to be a kuga wa wale na yak hika onenge na mo pilum.
kitla mo kheth kesteni for job interview ke mathoma ke tla mo kheth kesteni ke happy but ake tsebo after mo go tla dragalang after the interviews ke takala tsa mathlotsi for America o ke tetsong for interviews morning wani and welcome to Keith Kirstens Morning, Brian. How are you? Well, and you? Good, thanks. Did you get here all right this morning? No problems. I get dressed very well. Fantastic. Yes. We're here for an interview process this morning. Um, you, you're going to be interviewed for a position of a, a garden centre salesman or horticulturalist salesman. Uh, to get things um, started, I see I've got your CV here. Thank you for sending it through. Um, tell me a little bit about yourself, Winnie. Tell me uh, a little bit about your family, where you've studied, and uh, just Draw a picture for who Winnie is for me, please. Okay, my name is Winnie. I'm from Limpopo, Mukopani. I went to college with the health Nikon. I was doing nursing, but it's not it was that one is not my passion. And then I just study horticulture in UNISA. Then I just finished the horticulture course with this diploma. Then I just go around and hunt uh, in, uh, internships for more experience about the horticulture because I was not even knowing what is a horticulture. But now I'm happy I'm in the industry of horticulture. What does horticulture mean to you today? Horticulture, it's a science and art where we provide uh, marketing and providing marketing and, and, and producing using plants, flowers, and some vegetables and fruits. Okay. Tell me your experience in actually gardening. Have you got your hands dirty? Have you actually got out there and planted plants? Yes. I started by uh, sowing these seeds for the plants, small colors like begonias and petunias, and then making in, uh, displays, working more about uh, giving the customers an information to sell them the plant, where they're gonna plant it, where they're gonna create a small garden or just to make a decorative inside the house, like using the indoors and outdoors, something like that. Okay, so you, you, you've got your hands dirty? Yes. Okay. And um, past experience in customer relations? Have you worked in businesses where you've interacted with customers? Yes. You have? Yes. At, at Lifestyle, I was working as a sales to help the customer, telling them about the plants. Okay. Tell, tell them about the plants. Yes, how they're going to grow, how they're going to use compost, fertilizer and stuff like that. Oh, wonderful. So you do have some experience. How long did you work there for? One year. One year? Yes. And any other experience in the green industry? In the in green industry, Sanbi, I volunteered for one year okay. to know about the invasive alien plant, how to, how to sow the seeds, how to propagate, how to... How to, how to collect the seed harvesting and stuff like that in industry for everything. To collect the weeds, clean our areas, a lot of things we do there. Tell me a little bit more about your, your interaction with uh, fellow people, with people that you work with. What happens if you can't answer a question, if a customer asks you a question? How are you able to either pass that customer on to somebody else or say to the customer, I don't know, can I find out quickly? Are you able to do that? Uh, let me say, firstly, I was, I would just give the customer, then if she asks something which I don't know, then I'll say, okay, ma'am, I will ask someone to, to give you inf a, a correct information about the plants, then say, you're welcome. Okay. We, we, we currently employ um, 17 people, um, 11 of us are, are salesmen. Um, I'm not a strong believer in only being a salesman. You know, you will find your job entails more than just selling plants. You will have a section. Um, I don't think you can sell something unless you confidence in it. So you will find if you get the opportunity to work with us, you will move between sections. So one month you will work in the roses you will be expected to cut them or prune them, fertilize them, rebag if there are any broken bags, relabel. The whole idea there is that you just get a better understanding of roses. The next part of the interview is we're actually going to head outside. We're going to get those hands dirty. We're going to call on one of the staff members out there or one of the managers to work with you and um, mentor you in three different aspects of the business. 
so we can then get a better understanding of just how practical your knowledge is. All right, so um, I think we might even give you a Keith Kirsten shirt so you blend in out there if there are customers around. Um, we will look at doing three tasks and then we'll address after those three tasks and see how it went. All right. Okay, thank you. Winnie, let's go. We know also by Anna Louis to Melo Hatler Hokamusevitu Ona. Only Gila Hotelosa experience a high, let's say, or an Anglio Nakadijalo. Mahaslasi, Hopolang or Winu or Let's Mahaye. Ha Aruti Suaka Lemilas Hoa, Capatevo Yatavidiso ya computer. Emba, Ha Adumela Seu, Horasimu Tibelo who finia la Legaling Lena, La Hoti culture. And assessing Sahape Asian thing, we dress easy, Horiana Lemilena, or great Tutalona, who fit La Mona Remona, a Wolega Manzu. Le di sa manyora ha le ya o qetela e le yona ya dipatlisiso a wa hasla wini re mmona a le karolong ya pele yo mela ke sophelele ukuthi sikhusela imvelo phela futhi sikhumbula ukuthi asebenzise ibhlabha ke ama national resources kulo ngakhulu ukuthi ukhohle ukuthi sibhekane nesomiso uma ke uqhuba amazinyo wakho uyeke impompe nje igijimele noma ke ugeze for 20 minutes ukhohle ukuthi uhulumene ke usobeke imithetho ama water restrictions emadolobheni amaningi akuleli sina sifuna ukwazi wenzani ukonga amanzi mhlambe ke ugeza nomngane ukonga amanzi sale sipawuleni khona lapha nakuthi Twitter abafethi nishele ukuthi eyiphi into enisebenzelayo khona ke sokwazi Fundisa Abanya, kuna lapa na go Twitter na go Facebook. Good day, I'm Carrie. Carrie Goodwin actually, and I work here at Keith Kirsten. I'm the manager. I'm really excited today because I'm going to be Winnie's mentor and I get to show you guys all about how wonderful horticultural jobs are. Welcome to our team, Winnie. Okay, welcome. I think what we're going to do now is your first task is to set it up a display. Yes. And we thought because kitchen gardening and food gardening is so important, mm -hmm. that's what we want to try and promote. And we want to tell people these are all the different plants that they can plant in their garden, whether it be in containers or pots. It can create an environment where they can sit, have a drink. Yes. And it just, it's going to be smell, I'd like it to have plants that smell beautiful and then plants are edible. So that's what we want to put into your first display and then we'll see how you do it. I'm going to get someone to help you out as well. Okay, that would be lovely. So in task one, what Winnie has to do is provide a kitchen garden. So the first thing was to find a space to do it. The next thing was choose the plants that were going to go into that space. And so that's what she has to do. so Winnie this is the area that we're going to use to set up the kitchen display okay okay um, we put some of the things that you'll need like pots and some sort of plants you can have a look here and see what they've got okay and then I've got Sylvia to just give you a hand because some of the stuff could be quite heavy okay, that would be lovely and myself if you need me to give you a hand as well it's okay. all gonna come from your direction okay? okay because this is part of your interview process okay so you're gonna say to us what you want where help us out where you can okay and then just yeah tell Sylvia and myself what to do 
Okay. Okay, so shall we get started? Yes, we can start with this part to okay. put next to the arch. Okay. Both sides. We're going to push the trolley there yeah. and carry the pot. We're going to push it first. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So at least we know you're nice and strong here. Yeah? We'll be able to push these heavy trolleys up our nice stuff. Okay, we put one here. Yada naga matomo ki tomilo ko sunbi kidera landscaping. Yona neli shapo but but the thing ko kore neki sa tivi dilozo di unza to na da il like neli difficult ni ana and then ka ka feta mo hakilo mo and then ka. Cavalli said, Dila Horre, Reza Yang Dilo, in an addition, according to colors and grouping some plants and everything. So, are all the plants that you're using there are completely edible so far? Yes, are edible. Except so the Bongonvillias. Yeah. It's just for the color of the garden. Oh, okay. Because I give it color. Horticulture is actually a study of plants. Um, a lot of people think it then goes into when you know go and study at a university and that type of thing or a technicon. It's to do with more on the agricultural side of things, so it goes to wheat. But and then we go to more specific crops, so like apples, pears, and then what we study in here, or what we're trying to promote, is actually ornamental horticulture. And then the ornamental horticulture includes all these beautiful plants that we have outside the soil science, the seeds, that sort of production. So it's anything really to do with plants and how to get them to grow, how to beautify environment. Yeah, we can put this one and that one, we can put it in this corner, I'm gonna need something. Or that corner there, it's gonna need something. Or we can put it, or he, because here they're going to put a color. The color. Uh -huh. so here. Let's put it at the corner. Corner. Yeah. Go. Oh, put this a little bit, a little bit. Uh -uh. Yeah. Yeah. And the other one. Maybe we should put this one next to the lavender, next to the pot. Oh, they, and around the marigold. Enjoy your work at the plant because you can tell her I'm from Salabunya and then you get out of work or work at the plant. Or you can't work plant or you live in the house and you drink. And I come from. And now, let's take the begonias. You can put it there to close. To close it? Yeah? yeah, until to that pot. We decided to look for a kitchen garden. Got the herbs, the trees, the some color. So until we learn, we have a combination of colors. Go to pot room. Now, when we look at the different departments within horticulture, what we look at it mostly is either growing, okay, so how do the plants come about? Then the other one is how do we, us as retailers, how do we sell the plants, how do we get them into the customers' gardens? Then the next one is to do with landscaping. So if the customers are not buying them themselves, then it opens all the doors for forming landscaping companies, going into landscaping. It actually also includes, which is a surprising one, but does quite a, offers a lot of job opportunities, is golf golf course management, golf turf management. So all your grass fields, you know, um, sports fields, that also falls under our industry. In task, good task in your Okay, so it looks like you're almost done. When you were saying that we've, you've put some of the beautiful marigolds, yellow, yeah. bright colors, next to the herbs, what is the purpose of that? For color or for another reason as well? The reason why I put the marigold is to chase the aphids from my herbs yeah. and also for the color. Okay. So I like that they work as an insect repellent. So when I had a look at what she did in task one, I really liked her choice of the different products that she used. Um, 
I think one of the things that she did was to create different interest. So it would appeal to different customers of different ages, which was quite important. So there was your good classic lemon tree, which to me appeals to everyone. We know Oma Folo Folo, Obon Sabo Pilo Sebagang Sena, and a was super or on a lepono, Gasse Abatlan Hosebuka, Sebo Casa Horticulture, Ginto Ebu Sogwa, and a happy mona, or Sokar Oban and Lisebo Casa Huebo, Oban and Lebu Honi Casa Puo, Horo Hono Hosebes at the Taki Song, or Tasoka Sina Certificate, Eta Udumelan Horo Yet a Diploma, Gapa Degree, Met Physical Sciences, Gapatona de Life Sciences, the Compulsory, the Subject Setting Zedgo Tusang. Get on other agricultural sciences. Mahaslasi, check a hari ponezi, or talk our own lepono cabocam soba how. Sebadin, Hazelon di la petahaza, Emella, Udivia Ganya Hanyan Hanyani, Hasa Ukta Tilehe, Utaite Woha. Okay, Winnie, so now we're going to do task two, and that's to see how you um, sell to a customer, how you can help them. I think one of the most important things that you can do is actually listen to them so you can try and solve their gardening problems, you know, and just advise them as best you can. Okay. So that's what we're going to have a look and see what we can do now. All okay. Right. Next customer that comes in is yours. Okay. <laughs> Task two is meet and greet the client. And the most important thing here was for to be able to understand the needs of the customer, find out the position of the placement of the plants, and then help the customer choose the plants according to his likes. Load the plants on the trolley and sell them. Good day, sir. How are you? Fine, thanks. And you? Um, thanks. How can I help you? Mm, I've got a garden. My garden is five meters long, mm -hmm. and then there's a wall facing east. So that uh, there, there's three existing trees, mm -hmm. which is two two meters in between. So I would like to plant something permanent there with color, if possible. So will the, will you advise me with how what can I plant there? Yes, you can go through so I can show you. The way. Got a formal garden, meridian garden, kitchen garden. Kimo lo koro moto bia di plants the more herbs, edible ones, edible plants. And then the other garden, while it's only the flowers. I would like some color, and then you you show me what to do, what what to plant and and what. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, I've heard about that, the indigenous stuff, the water white, so I would like that. Okay. And then, is, is that the only one that you can show me, or you can show me some other? Okay, yes. I would like color. So the seed that we purchased within the garden center, it's um, either, is, some of it is hybridized, but not genetically modified. Um, you know, because there's quite a, within farms and things, people use genetically modified food because they're going to get higher crop production. And it is a, a field of horticulture that people can go into to try and see how we can get the best crops to be able to feed our growing population. Okay, this is Acapentas. We've got blue velvet. Yes. Snowpool raw, which is white. We've got dwarf uh, blue. We've got lilac, beauty. Which one do you like? Mm, I like the blue ones. The blue ones? Yes. You said your place is about five meters in the pile. Two meters. This is two meters? In between trees, yes. So you're going to need uh, five of them. Five of them, okay. Just by my able to stick at the plant, they look for a little bit of shade, semi shade. But lady plant is the one shade. Then you can get a monsatona, which is the acapenthas. And then with the hurry. But the level garden is high. It's about five meter. Then around the plant, it's a little ring. It's a little cover that five meter. Then about the little ground covers, it's a little ring. It's about the semi shade. Then we fill it with a roller. Then about the little something, it's a little ring. It's a little cover about two meter. Go garden is high. And about the hedging, then ramfa jalus mamu. 
which is smelling very nice. Do you have any borehole or are you using a sprinklers or using? It's just sprinklers. Sprinklers. Yes. And a sprinklers, you know, it's municipal water. Okay. So, so waterway stuff, it's, I think it's the best. Okay, this is the dance mom. Okay. The one that you're going to use as a hedging. So how many of these will I need for that? Maybe you can take two, it's fine. Two. Okay. If you can say two meters, going to be four. And it will be fine. Yeah, I trust your judgment. You're gonna count it on, on your legs. This is two meter. You do look good because of customer. Uh, I don't understand that it's a little bit more fluid on the end and enjoy it because of Urla Arabic sprinkler to water, water the plant is a hair, which is good because I always the meat. Sprinkler say we do the tenor only, then later the tenor on. So you said you're going to give me the color, mm -hmm. which is the begonias, and then you've been showing me those. Where is the begonias? Yes. Okay, I'll show you there up. You like mix or one color? Mix color. Is it full sun or semi shade? You said it's shade. Yes, yeah, semi shade. Okay, I'm gonna give you the brown leaf because they can take semi shade to shade, and the green one can take shade also. Okay. To be able to have marketing and business skills is really important within horticulture, and I think people are starting to realize that because. I want to say a long time ago, or originally, horticulture just used to be a passion. And people used to, you know, they would start growing vegetables and then start growing plants and then form a little business and then sell their plants to other people. And that's how it came about. Okay, now you're going to take a ground cover, which is the begonia, in its water works. Okay. So this is the one that are going to give me color? Yes. You said you want the mix. Yes, the mix. Okay. I like the mix. This is the mixed. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Just get a very little customer. Give good little get get happy little because of customer. He le appreciate that little thing. I'm feeling so nice. Little one, nearly happy. And then eh, as I'm going to do complain, then I get a little customer. The next day, have we a whole garden here? Now you're going to the tills. You're going to fetch up compost then fertilizer. Thanks. Do you like the delivery mode? I think Winnie actually, she exceeded my expectations when helping the customer because she was friendly and welcoming. She listened really well to what the customer actually needed. You know, she didn't preempt too much. She listened to when he said, okay, it needs to be on an east wall. Um, so she, in her mind, she was already picturing where the sun was going, how it was going to affect the plants that she chose. We know on a list of the other tools. How we know for the customer, how about the tools of the other, little girls of the other. Mahaslasi, bokhoni bana. We know how to fumana the tuto ya haifela. On nete fadi tor ufumana experience, hore atwa huika ha. Eno oyenza seu kahu volunteer. The horticulturist, when they are born, they are the parking, the polishing, they are the country, they are the the participation. How only horticulturist? Or tell me how urban life is all about. Or how they are the country and how they are creative. Check the hard table. The jalo and the palace. The entire fata. Empa. The tell me how all the people are customers. Or how they are the Task three is all about trying to get rid of pests in the garden center. We're an environmentally friendly garden centre and we only sell organic products. So what we're trying to do is encourage the customers to move to an environmentally friendly way of you know, their lifestyle. But at the same time, we have to have good healthy plants for them to sell. So I thought maybe you could spray some of the roses for us using the products that we have. And then also give them a bit of food and you'll be able to tell me why you've chosen the food that you wanted and the different sprays that we need to be able to do the task that I've given to you. 
Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's go and have a look and see what we can do. So the third task is within any growing environment, you're gonna get pests. So she's gonna to have to choose the product that's environmentally friendly to spray on the pests, mix it up, how does she dilute it? Does she need a mask or not? And then how does the product work on the pests? She needs to be able to explain that. Hustlers, they want to get in, got the a cool ambulance there too. Or one of our cool local members cut some shot of a fetch. Shama convoy, sell up a number of typical gardens of a fetch. So Tata E, Tombe, Namigan Kulusa, and Shire in Gatti of a fetch. Bengal Blanc, Blanc, Bengal, Lapana, Giffing of Tobi, Lapana Chanin of a fetch, Kulchanibus of Shaza. You want to get my tips and now, but again, some niggas are my tips. Kulapana get who were jumbo. But I'm going to get a letter A, your the which is the letter R. The people who are going to lend out, but Tata in Boni, by his Sasha is cool. How? You think you send me as a much of a fit? I am not a gnomosa. I didn't tag a nanda to Makai. Got a gonaman, so she must wear ember with care for spoon with the Iraz Lapana, your Kubaran and Jabaka, your shy, in merchandising. The one I beg is in Tongan, like Emilia Zimena corner. Janga say doll, screaming it all over first to see a corner, Jenga manje. I'll see you on the other side where the grass is greener. So I've put the tools and things that we would need. Apart from actually spraying the roses, I think you know it's a good thing to keep your plants healthy all the time. So yeah, I'll put something else here. You might have to explain to me why you're using it and how we would use it. Okay, off you go. Yes, I'm going to use a Ludwig insect spray to spray my aphids. Yes. This spray is an organic, doesn't have any harmful to your body. That's why, you can, as you can see, me, I didn't have a mask, I didn't have any glove, but uh, to other nasalies, we do use them. Yeah. Then, this one is called a garlic smell. And oh, then, um, just <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And we've got canola oil. Okay. So, this is quite, for me, a very important task because it shows that we have to have a little bit of a maths background. You have to be able to work with numbers to be able to dilute the concentration. It's not a ready to use. So okay. good luck to you on that one. Okay, here's my spray bottle. I'm gonna put 500 mils of water. Good test number three, or very say insect spray from Ludwig. It's because of the roses starting to develop in the blueberries, but the effects. And then why Robert did prevent or destroy the bloom of the roses? Because if the effects, the bloom of the roses, it should not go for what she is. This one is gonna be ten minutes. Okay, how do you, did you know that because you've worked in other garden centers that you know how much it is to dilute? Yes. Or, and if people didn't know, how would you teach them to know? Firstly, you have to check how area for your if it's, uh, it's about two meters, it's about, then you're gonna read the readings for, per yeah. liters. Mm -hmm. Then they will tell you if we've got uh, instruction inside, then okay. you have to read, then okay you will see everything inside. One of my friends over analyzed the apple, so the apple is high, the flower really, then already it's about not the apple. Then, I have a lot of ideas for America, one of the organic, a spray, the bloom is high, or I prevented those small things to eat the fruit or the spray of the ball. So, barata am going to go to because I'm going to go to the garden, but I'm going to go to the garden. Okay, so it's completely diluted. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. As you can see, the water has changed. Yeah. It's become like a milky color now. So I think what we're going to do is start here with the burgundy icebergs and then move further and further on. And you're just going to have to check, you know, we're going to spray completely, but you also want to spray on the buds more than the actual blooms themselves because that's where the bees are going to be getting their pollen from. So buds and leaves, off you go. Do you know why the aphids are attracted to the new buds? Not quite sure about the answer. 
Okay, so it's because they're really looking for fresh, juicy things. So it's like us having a salad, you know, you want something that's really nice and fresh compared to some of the older leaves and that type of thing. That's just their path to get there. I am Fabutata. Maybe from other people, maybe the girl Fabutata because of Robin Hemaberekisa. The chemical, the chemical, it was organic, organic, any problem harmful with my body. But in choice, I said, it's a good reason to protect my before we get the insecticides. While you're busy doing this, is there a correct time of the day to spray or can you spray any time? You, sp you can spray at any time if you see the effects on the buds or on the leaves. Mm -hmm. And we can continuously spray after seven days because we've got uh, the eggs. You, you can kill the aphids now, the one that you see, but the eggs, the small ones in the eggs, still alive. Oh, uh, okay. Then you have to do continuously after seven days. Okay. I was a mentor who was happy because the tasks were so hard to do, and then I was told that I had to do the tasks that were so hard to do. Okay. 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 Did you survive? I think so. You did? Did you enjoy it? Yes, I did very well. Right. You did well? Okay, well done. Can enjoy. Tell me more about your, your, your mentor was Carrie. Yes. Carrie is the business owner here. Yes. So she took you out into the nursery. What was your first task that you had to complete? My first task, it was display. The second task, it was... Uh, Tell me more about your first task, your display, your mentor. What did Carrie do and help you with? Carrie, she was helping me, helping me to bring me the plants so that I can place the way I planned to do my display with other employees from here. Like that. And ask, also ask the question about the plant, why I'm putting those plants, what, what, what are the purpose of putting that plant next to each other, combination of uh, colors, why are you doing that? Then I just answered the question that the, she asked. So now how do we know it was successful? She was very happy while I was doing. Fantastic. And I heard you sold a product out of it. Yes. Okay, so that's always a good sign then. So the customer related to the display that you're doing, you solved the problem in the customer's mind. Maybe that plant would have looked good in their garden or their home and they bought it. So uh, from Carrie's report, I heard it was a great display work. So um, speaking to your mentor, Carrie, who actually went and spoke to the customer afterwards, what was the customer's experience? The customer said he felt that you did have knowledge. So to me, that's important. And he felt that you were a very friendly person. So again, to me. So in the three different tasks that you've been assigned with your mentor outside, you seem to have done quite well. So what do you think that means? It means I've got a job. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think there is a possibility that we are going to employ you. I think we will work on a, 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 a trial basis. We would like to offer you a position for a three-month trial, and the outcome of that is there could possibly be a permanent job for you. So uh, congratulations. Wonderful. It was fantastic meeting you, interviewing you. I really think you fit the culture of our business and I think you will enjoy your stay with us. Congratulations. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. Welcome to the team. Okay. Honjale ke tla tloga mo ke ke stene eh ke fela ke le happy on jwaje because of ke re le prohibition ya 3 months for job and then after that ke tlo bara ka hard gore ke tholem 
a permanent one, then Ronjoaje, uh, take a plan and you take it whatever, we give it away, and then you say, which let any curriculum, mama, and Jenny Kimuse Pisayona for a present to all my hustlers, Pressa, Pusha, Panda. Well done, Winnie. Re two till a row and a whole half fella on a lepono. O tapa di tela limits a maya how o tat oil. Boto yarona yabeke ena is oko pumzile. Ariana on a lehato ya we two tela agriculture. Pumzile o took a senior certificate. Eta would you melan for oyeta yon a diploma kapa degree. Mathly physical sciences a kailo. Di compulsory. Di subject said in the cow to sa house and an olis colon. Get on other agricultural sciences. Di life skills. Let's say economics. Hasso on a let's on a hair. Okaya institutioning away ratang. Where it's a diploma kapa degree. Ya agriculture. Chakela bale papala agrisita. Bona hair banali di bazari. Ha fella on a le metrikwa how. On a le South African ID. And a week emi said it's a we tutela agriculture. On a le ratola agriculture. Uta pumella. Hi, Kaba Hona Lohosa Wudwang. Hope you check out Facebook, Kaba website, ya Rona. Game it's your how bozo. Good to you, Uvuna Loko Ochalile, Uwini Bafetu Ochalile, one is a lag, exosalake, Esel Camille and Gatti, Imbali, and Tosa Chobo Bafetu, Likanya, Ba, Tosit Hala Logan of Fetu, Interazienzum Sevens, Omos, Natus Ikarakinao, Isokula, Intergabali, Nazi Sasha, Sfile Mafini, but in the Lapomoka and Hambaranjani, Omar can Utu Pendla, it will jumble manji, get my figure of your lunch, Umtogu Supelile, that comes a crash. Speaking of which, Eka Magata Silfuna Lapanagu will jumble. Buffet, he necessary in the way about Kulusa is that a late tell of a fetch, which is cool as in the Gobal is even cool. Umaru Utuling is I am cool man. Umma to Langa, not about Nisa Langa Gatuena, Musu Katazera, who figures our fetch, especially anywhere jumble on a shake Uza Mayako in Tanta, selling issues and Kangan in the Panaga and Kunjas of Kuman Buffet, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, and also our website. Uncle Will Amar Pitch Buffet, go Thursday, go eleven o'clock. Minagan give Valanga Makama Buffet to Mau Moon to have strong roots Buffet. No man figure if Vung Vung. Mustu Narazo and Shalaga Epupel Lako, Uzuzu Fig, is the Zoba Nandi, get him in a challenge, press a push upon the Ungape Pond, Bega Pezu, and see the money trees. See you next week.